What is that? A rainbow. You like drawing rainbows, huh? Michaela McCauley was diagnosed with leukemia in 2000. Michaela was literally my everything. Uh, she was my first daughter. And, um... She just, she was just happiness. Doctors told Krista McCauley McKella would need a bone marrow transplant. We put her face on the, on the news asking for people to come out and donate bone marrow and they came out in thousands. Unfortunately, a match wasn't found in time. McKella um, has quite a mix. Um, I'm Native American and also um, Hispanic. Her father is um, Canadian, uh, Irish, so she had quite a mix of genes and so that makes it harder to find a match and we did a worldwide search and um, we couldn't find a perfect match for her. Michaela passed away October 2001. Whatever I do, I just want to continue to keep her memory um, alive. This Saturday, Michaela will be one of the honor at the Bakersfield Ronald McDonald House's annual Walk for Kids, an organization Macaulay remembers fondly. It was a week that we stayed in the Ronald McDonald House in Madeira, and it's when my daughter had went into ICU. So we couldn't stay in the room with her, and just to know that I was literally a walk across the parking lot to her was great. The Ronald McDonald House provides families with a place to stay while their child is in the hospital. Just knowing we give families time that they may not otherwise have had with their child. And I think that's the most meaningful part of our job. All proceeds of the walk go to the house. Director Scarlett Sabin says the funds raised during the walk amount to two-thirds of the organization's annual budget. It's a great cause. Come out um, and, and every little bit helps. So whatever you can donate to the Ronald McDonald House, again, it does stay here locally and it's such a worthy cause.